this body of work, Man of War, uh, here at the Edge of Radio Gallery. So we're lucky because uh, Theo agreed um, to, to talk about his work and I did. We're here to talk about this, Man of War. And earlier today there's an article that went live from uh, Vice magazine with quite a catchy headline, which is, Athea Musawi thinks drones are like jellyfish. <laughs> and I guess that's where I want to start. Okay. Can you tell me, in terms of your art, the connection between jellyfish and drones? Yeah, uh, <coughs> hey, thanks everyone for coming. Firstly, it means a lot. Um, and wow, those faces and lovely people. Um, yeah, the the connection was the kind of the starting point. Um, and just watching kind of uh, like unmanned warfare kind of evolve. Um, the, the the thing that you see kind of happen is like guilt is something that is kind of being uh, removed at every level. Um, so if I if I hit you, then you feel bad, but I feel bad. And then, like every stage of, of, of warfare, it, it removes to the point where you, I was watching, obviously, on the news, these drones kind of, you know, through the sky and causing so much destruction from below. Mm -hmm. But there's, there doesn't, that element of uh, kind of guilt is just, it's felt like that next stage of attachment. And, um, <clears throat> I guess I started to make the parallel between that and a jellyfish, um, mainly because a jellyfish doesn't have a brain, but they, they actively will hunt and kill. And they've just been doing it very peacefully for millions and millions of years. And um, I, I, yeah, that's kind of where the connection started. Mm. So all the works have essentially jellyfish bodies um, on the top and then uh, kind of impact strikes on the below. Thank you. 